here you can see my vacuum filament dryer using a pressurized tank container from Harbor Freight. We're actually using it as a vacuum. If you notice, it is pulling quite a bit of vacuum right now. About minus 29 inches of mercury. And a vacuum pump bought off of Amazon and a nice piece of braided line as the vacuum line from the tank to the pump and some valves. Oh, the valves are bought at Home Depot. And there's a uh, desiccant dryer on the uh, thing I use to let the air into it while I want to open it up. So, if I'm going to let the air back in, might as well dry it as much as possible. And surrounding it are seat warmers. To the uh, container. The container can take quite a bit of pressure, but it also holds a lot of vacuum. And so, when I want to release it, I'll just open up this valve here. You can hear it start sucking in air. The vacuum level goes up. Otherwise, I'll just keep that sucker plugged. And I want to get more vacuum in there. 